Hello everyone and welcome to Gemini Soul Tarot. Today we will be doing a check-in and energies regarding in there quick energy check-in and it's coming from the soul is whatever spirit guides lead me to. This may not resonate with everyone. If it does not resonate with you, please throw it out into the universe to someone that does need it. I know tarot reading is for Pisces for the next seven days and it is called the soul check-in. So to put it in the playlist to make it easier for you guys. If you do find that anything resonates in this video for you, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and share. And so that you do not miss any other uh, check-ins if you like this type of energy when I bring forth the messages to you guys in the soul energy of Gemini. Alright, so let's just start off with the Kipper card for overall reading. And again, this is for Pisces for the next seven days. Spirit guides, what do we have for Pisces? And what will Pisces be dealing with over the next seven days? Pisces, you have family room. Hmm. Family room, Pisces. Family room. Pisces, you are dealing with some family issues. I always see this family room card here as it's empty right so i don't know if you're gonna fill it up or you're gonna continue to let it be empty like that but let's see what the spirit guys have we're gonna go with the psychic deck this one here is uh, the oracle deck so i'm gonna ask the spirit guys to give me something to help clarify more uh understanding of this family room that we have from the kipper deck let's see what we have for pisces spirit guys give me the message that I need to see for Pisces over the next seven days, which is within their soul, the energies within their soul that they may be surrounded with or dealing with over the next seven days. All right, Pisces, let's get into it. Spirit guys, show me what I need to see when it comes to Pisces uh, soul check in over the next seven days spirit show me what i need to see for pisces so check in the next seven days we have the heart chakra we have the heart chakra here all right Pisces. so we dealing with family that that don't surprise me because you when you comes with family you know you're dealing with the heart right so it's like we got to make decisions. What we got? What we got when it comes to family? Who ain't right? Who is right? Maybe deciding on having a family or whatever it is, it is burdensome on your heart chakra. So you need to try to clear that out. I'm pretty sure we'll see as the reading goes on. But right now you have the family room and heart chakra. So I'm feeling that this is probably dealing with family, relationship, um, it could always turn to a job, right? Depending on what it is. Let me see. What are we guided to, Spirit, for this? All right. We're going to go with the right way to get the storyline for Pisces. Storyline for Pisces. Let's see what we're dealing with, Pisces. Let's see what we're dealing with over the next seven days for Pisces. Spirit guys, show me what I need to see when dealing with Pisces over the next seven days, connecting to the soul and the energy surrounding them. All right, we just all mixed up here, okay? <laughs> all righty, Pisces. Right. One more spirit, just to make sure we got it shuffled up really good. Okay, and let's get into it. We have the Queen of Swords separated and wanted to come out. Spirit said, take it. We're going to put the Queen of Swords right there. All right. As we get into Pisces. So, Pisces, I'm seeing right away that some of you want to talk some truth or you want some truth got to do with the family. And you was just like, okay, something's weighing hard on the heart. Um... Okay, Spirit, that's a lot. That's a lot. Okay, you said take it. Let's move it. 
All right, the first card we got out, we got a page of cups. Definitely could be dealing with children, okay? Is that no surprise that we're dealing with the family room? Oh, along with the children, we got conflict, okay? All right, right away, I'm getting the, the raising of children, the background, the, the way you see things, the way you feel children should be raised. Uh, maybe someone's uh, beliefs are not the same as yours, Pisces. Next, we have um, the Three of Cups. So we got the Three of Cups here. And that's definitely family and celebration. Maybe y'all had a family sub celebration and it just turned out to be nothing but conflict. Kids was running around just acting a fool. Y'all know you both have been six feet apart. I don't know how y'all out there celebrating like this, Pisces. But maybe uh, you had a family gathering and there was a lot of conflict involved. Maybe we got children, adults. It just became a conflict. And uh, you were seeing the truth in the situation. So whatever is going on in this situation, you already knew the truth or you wanted the truth, right? But your heart is burdened by it because, you know, family, it, it takes a whole nother toll when you talk about family. Um, under the deck, you had somebody trying to rush in and communicate this, probably about this conflict that went on between the uh, family or the children's or people seeing di different things. It could have been somebody showed up where we had like a little hangout or something with the family and uh, maybe somebody, a guest showed up unexpected. That could be a third party. I'm just saying because you got conflict here, you got children. It could have also been we found out some information we didn't need to know. Is that mine? Is it not? I don't know. I mean, Pisces, you take it where it resonates. I'm just going with everything that I'm hearing at this time. But if that's the truth, you want the truth, Pisces. You like, I want the truth. What is you like and if I don't get the truth, uh there's gonna be a problem because uh I have the world in my hand and I'm going to move forward and leave uh all this drama behind if somebody don't give me the truth in this situation. I don't care if your family, friends, or whoever you is. I am looking for the truth because otherwise I'm going to move on. The two of ones is somebody making a decision that like y'all better come clean. They need to come clean with it. You know, maybe you had somebody show up there looking good as I don't know what, right? Maybe this somebody exed and showed up. And you like, where in the world? Because they got the world in their hand, right? You're like, where in the world they came from? And everybody's sitting there looking in the family room like, oh, I didn't even know they was coming. I didn't invite them. How did they come? You know, I don't know. <laughs> but they didn't came to the family event and shouldn't have even been there because ain't nobody invited them. They didn't show up, at least you think. But you're going to find the truth out, Pisces. <laughs> you say you're going to find out the truth why you didn't show up here at this event. And I didn't invite you, especially Pisces, if you did. Oh, yeah, because that was deceptive. That, that was like somebody just, uh-uh. They tried to get away with that. They tried to not involve you. They tried to not make make you aware of what was going on. This here, this is, uh, you need to look into it. And you want the truth, you know. Who lying? Who stealing? Or did somebody come and just steal some stuff? Like, you know, this deceptive energy here. This is, and I wouldn't even say that if it wasn't here with this five of wands and these three of cups and you being here sitting here in your power with this sword. Oh, I hope it wasn't you, Pisces. You is acting up. I hope that wasn't you over the next seven days acting up. You got an event coming up. You know, it's hard for us to come together as it is. And then y'all come together and y'all got all this deceptive energy, lying, stealing. Somebody ain't telling the truth about something. You know, I can see you looking for some stuff like after the party or the event is over, I'm looking for stuff. Somebody done stole something, some jewelry. They done stole a watch. I don't know what they didn't did. I don't know. They took something that belonged to them, right? Maybe they stole a bottle of wine or something. I don't know what they did. But you like, I want the truth from everybody that was here. And you calling to me. And look. And you stand in your guard. You standing by the door. Can't nobody leave until I figure out what is going on. And I know I got the higher ground because I got an idea 
who may have done this? You like, I got an idea. Who may have done this? You know? So and they up there talk about, uh, wait a minute, <laughs> wait a minute. It was one of the kids. It was one of the uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. You like, uh-uh, I'll see the truth in this. It was not a child. It was not a child. Y'all got guests showing up that we didn't invite. You know we got to be six feet apart. And that's why I don't get with the family. Because every time we get with the family, it's always some conflict. People always getting into it, doing stuff they don't have. No business when we should actually be celebrating. But you go to inviting your exes here. And somebody didn't show up that was not invited. And you were not happy about this situation, Pisces. I don't know if it resonates, but I tell you one thing, it happened before. So this ain't brand new. So don't, you know, don't act like it's new because this is the Ten of Swords. This Ten of Swords is some, somebody, okay, Pisces, somebody didn't play this game with you far too long. If they didn't play it far too long, this deceptive energy. Now, if it isn't somebody showed up for an event or whatever it is, you're going through somebody lying, stealing, cheating, or something. They doing something behind your back. But you know the truth in it. You're asking for the truth, and you already know the truth in it. But the thing is that this has been going on far too long, Pisces. Now, you need to take control of the situation. That's what I would say. Take control of the situation because that's the Ten of Wands. That's, uh, that's the Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords. That's like end. That's done. I'm like done with this situation. I'm not dealing with it anymore. I want the truth. Uh, and you garden. You guard it. You like, mm -mm, I got the upper hand in this because this has been going on far too long and somebody needs to stand up and say something. And right under that, you got the the higher friend. The higher friend is the right thing. Like somebody come truth, come forth and tell the truth about this event, this situation or something that happened that they were trying to keep away from you, Pisces. Now, I don't know what it is. Kids, it's a relationship, it's third party, somebody's stealing, uh, or just a family event gone wrong. It's just a family event gone wrong. And that could be happening this weekend, over the week, maybe somebody's birthday coming up. Maybe you're trying to get together somebody's anniversary. You could be doing a graduation. I don't know what the situation is, but it had to do with the family room. So it's definitely got to do with family. So whatever this deception is, it's family. And it's also heartbreaking to you because whoever you suspect or think is causing all this drama with this low vibe energies in the family, you are pretty pissed off, but you are moving on to karma waters. You're like, you know what? I don't even want to deal with this no more. I'm going to move on to calmer waters, get in my little boat, and go go, go elsewhere and, and leave all this and leave all this alone. Because basically, you really don't have to. You know why, Pisces? Because look, Pisces, do you see you? You the nine of pentacles. That's the nine of pentacles. You don't really need anyone. But you want to associate with these people, right? Because, you know, they say, oh, you so all off to yourself and, you know, over there with your funds and you're working and doing everything over there. You don't never come to family events. You don't call. You don't text. You don't do none of that. And you're like, but that's why. That's why I stay over there in my own abundance because when I show up, this is the type of stuff that happens. Conflicts, exes showing up. Third party situations, people stealing at the family. There was it a family reunion? I don't know. You like, but this is why I don't show up. And then I gotta be the one that try to figure out what the heck is going on, and everybody looking at me because I'm guarded about the situation, right? I'm guarded, and the reason I got the upper hand because at the end of the day, when this is over, I get to go home to my own abundance and not have to deal with this. I don't have to deal with them kids, you know? Y'all all got these kids. Well, I know who, mama, daddy, fathers, whoever, whatever. This whole situation is just a complete conflict. We got baby mama showing up or baby daddy showing up or people just not invited, long time family, old relationships. And if you seeing this situation for exactly what it is, you're like, you know what? 
The truth is the truth. This is my family, and I love them to death. Because that's where that heart shock will come in. You ain't got no choice. <laughs> you don't have any choice, Pisces. You're like, this is my family, and they just act up. I don't, I don't even know what to do. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to head out to my abundance and my place and close the door. Because and, 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 it may not be no truth coming out. I want the truth from this situation so that it can calm down. But, you know, this has been going on too long in the family. you you only one person. You know, you got a whole family room here. How you going to fix all that, Pisces? You can't do it by yourself. You cannot do this by yourself, Pisces. So you're going to need to let that go. You're you going to need to just let it go. Hold on to your truth, whether you know it or not, and just, 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 just take your sword. <laughs> just go, go on, Pisces. I'm sorry. Over the next seven days. Don't even worry yourself and burn yourself with this low vibe energy. Because you might not never find out who stole what they stole. Or did you show up there because they came through? Maybe they came through and visit you and stole something from you. And whatever you trying to get, figure out who did what, you know already. You know the truth. But that hard shocker won't let you. It won't let you do nothing different. But, you know, that's what I see for you Pisces at this time. Uh, if anything in this reading did resonate with you, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, this is called Soul Energy Check-In. I just talk about whatever the energies of the guys, uh, my spirit guys, give me. Talking from the soul, and I try to keep it as real as possible. If you guys enjoyed this or you found any of this to be true over the next seven days, definitely come back. Thumbs up. Subscribe now so you don't miss any more check-ins. Even if you just love coming here to Soul Gemini Tarot on check-in days uh, to see the check-in readings. I thank you so much. And please, on your way out, please give a thumbs up. Just if it was entertaining to you, give a thumbs up and subscribe. Bye, Pisces.